Did Florida just become the 26th state in this country to allow constitutional carry? Stick around to find out. What's up, YouTube? Today, on April 3rd, 2023, Governor Ron DeSantis has officially signed the constitutional carry law in the state of Florida. Come on, man. And I'm sure, as you can imagine, the Democrats are none too pleased. So what does this new law actually mean? Well, effective July 1st of 2023, Floridians will no longer be required to have a concealed weapons permit to carry a concealed weapon in the state of Florida. Florida State Statute 790.06 outlines the criteria that is required to carry a concealed weapon in the state of Florida. All of those criteria still apply, except you're no longer required to have any type of specific training in order to carry a concealed weapon in the state of Florida. What does this mean for the current concealed weapons permit in the state of Florida? Well, good news is you can still get it even after this new law takes effect. The requirements to get the concealed weapons permit in the state of Florida will remain the same. It will not change as of July 1st. You might be wondering, well, why do I need a concealed weapons permit if Florida no longer is going to require it? Well, that Florida weapons permit is actually recognized in over 30 states. Another reason why you might want to keep your concealed weapons permit is because under current law, which also will not be changing, if you don't have a concealed weapons permit in the state of Florida, there's a three-day cooling off period for purchasing firearms from a licensed firearms dealer. If you have a concealed weapons, you do not have to wait that three-day grace period. If you're curious about the actual text of the new law, you can Google Florida State House Bill 543 for the full text version of this new law. Does the new Florida law allow you to openly carry a firearm in the state of Florida? The short answer is no. However, there is a part of the statute that allows persons to open carry a firearm if they are doing an outdoor recreational activity such as hunting or fishing. What are my thoughts about this new law? I'm 100% for it. I'm glad we're now the 26th state in our country to recognize constitutional carry and the need not to have a license or permission slip from our local government saying that we can exercise a right that's embedded in our constitution. I also understand the concern by some that training is no longer required to conceal carry a firearm in the state of Florida. However, based on my prior experience, anybody that legally and lawfully carries a firearm takes it upon themselves to go out and get properly trained to carry that firearm. I personally, when I purchase a firearm, I never carry it on my person until I've taken it to the range, I fired it, and I understand the mechanics of that firearm before I need to use it in a self-defense situation. I will continue to follow any new information that might come up between now when the law is implemented on July 1st. And if anything is impertinent, I'll be sure to pass it along. I am curious though, what do you think about constitutional carry in the state of Florida? Leave me a comment and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thank you and have a great day.